everybody in this video you're gonna see me trim out the catfish please these were given to me since I haven't been able to work so I haven't done a catch and cook but this one's just gonna be a comparison of Eileen's back bite barbecue sauce versus hot sauce and we'll put one filet in one Ziploc baggie with a uh, back bite sauce in it to let it uh, marinate overnight. And tomorrow I'll take them out, put them in uh, my seasoning flour, and cook them up in the cast iron skillet. And we, when we're done, we'll see which one comes out best. We're going to see if Eileen's back bite sauce is as good as the hot sauce. So, with that being said, let's get into it. All right, as you see, you got this bloodline right through here. We're just gonna cut it out, go right down next to it. Pop that out, take that, we'll come back and Catch that one up in a little bit, but we want to just basically cut out that center. A lot of people don't like it because that's a bloodline, which I don't like it at all myself, but we'll take these and cut them like that. Cut them into chunks. We'll bring this one over. Cut out that meat right there. Well, they didn't clean this fish out too well. But just cutting them up in chunks like that. I know this first bag I'm doing all these chunks I'm putting in here in this first bag is going to be Eileen's back bite sauce. Put enough in there just to get it all coated up really good. This is just an idea I wanted to try and see how it is. No. That's Eileen's back bite sauce. It looks just like hot sauce. It's spicy. It's not really, to me, it's not really a barbecue sauce. It's more like a homemade version of a hot sauce. Gotta get rid of that paper towel. I always want to use a paper towel because it helps. Hold the fish in place. 
Well, most of your cutting boards, they do not. Because you want to be able to get out all that blue line. Since this one curves, we're going to curve with it. And just cut there, cut there, and wherever you see that little piece of red meat, trim that out. Yeah, I do keep my knife, plenty of knives sharp. I like them chunks there because they're easier to cook. Uh, leave that just like that. Come back and just get right close to that. And trim it right out. That bloodline, a lot of people don't like it because it gives somewhat of a nasty flavor to it. It doesn't bother me none. But, mm, yeah, I just cut that one in half. All right. Now this one is gonna be just straight hot sauce and I'll put these in the fridge overnight when I get ready to cook we'll take them out and see how well they go I try to put about the same amount in each. I put liberal amounts in both, so. I'm gonna make sure I got enough to cover all the fish. Okay. Now you got the hot sauce and you got Eileen's back by sauce, back to back. And tomorrow, we shall see which one prevails. Will it be Eileen's backbite? Or will it be the hot sauce? Put your uh, votes in the comments below. Who, Which one do you think will come out the best? Will it be Eileen's? Or will it be the hot sauce? I'm curious what you people, what you people will say which one will come out best. With that being said, I'm going to stick these in the fridge overnight. Sit back and have a cold refreshing beverage. And relax. And I'll see you guys tomorrow.